Hey everyone, and welcome back to part three. Are water bottles bad for rabbits? Now I did do a part one and a part two to this video, and I'll link them in the description box below. Now in this video, I'm going to be talking about water bowls. Before I start this video, I want to remind people I'm not trying to press my opinion on which one is better. It's what's going to make your rabbit happy and keep him healthy. Water bowls are more of a natural way for your rabbit to drink water than from a water bottle because your rabbit isn't tilting its head when it's getting a drink of water. That is if you are not properly placing the water bottle at a right height. Now, it is also stated that rabbits will drink more water if they drink out of a bowl. My rabbit can drink out of either or and he drinks the same amount of water from either one of them, which is five to eight ounces. And it is dependent on the weather and on the temperature. He also gets four cups of veggies each day, which is the ideal amount that he should have for his body weight. So he is getting some of his water intake from his veggies. I know that there's rabbit owners that are wanting to make the switch from a water bottle to a water bowl or vice versa. And when you're doing this, you can offer both to your rabbit and see which one they pick or you can have both of them at all times for your rabbit. Now, you can try tempting your rabbit to drink out of a water bottle by smearing a little bit of apple or banana around the spout. And with a water bowl, you can add a little bit of unsweetened apple juice to your rabbit's water. Now, with water bowls, they may not work for every rabbit's area, or if you have a messy rabbit, or a rabbit that has a huge dewlap. Water can collect under the dewlap and may create dermatitis. There are different types of water bowls. Crock pots are great. They prevent your rabbit from spilling water everywhere. Now, depending on your cage, you may be limited on how low you can lower down the crock pot. For a small rabbit to reach over the rim of the bowl to have a drink, it may be a problem if you cannot lower it down at a correct height for them. You'll find what's going to work for your rabbit's area, and there's different types of bowls and containers that you can use in their area. I use a 16 ounce stainless steel water bowl. I fill it up twice a day, and I keep my bowl out of direct sunlight, and I wash my bowl out to prevent any type of bacteria growth from happening. Water is very important for your rabbit. It keeps the digestive tract moving and flushes excess calcium out of their system. When your rabbit is eating hay, dry foods, chewing on wood, or sisal rope, it may increase your rabbit's thirst. It's important to have fresh, clean water at all times and change the water twice a day. Rabbits prefer fresh, clean water. The recommended amount of your rabbit's water intake is 10% of your rabbit's body weight. As I mentioned, with my rabbit, it varies depending on the weather and the temperature, and he does get some of his water from his veggies. If you're worried about your rabbit's water intake, you can measure the amount of water that you're giving to your rabbit, and then you can measure the amount after when you are changing the water. If you have concerns about your rabbit's water intake, you can talk to a rabbit savvy vet. As I mentioned, if you're wanting to make that switch from a bottle to a bowl or vice versa, always offer both to your rabbit in their area. If your rabbit chooses a water bottle, that's fine. What matters is that your rabbit has fresh, clean water at all times. I'm not trying to press my opinion or say which one to use. It's what's gonna work in your rabbit's area and keep your rabbit happy and healthy. So that includes my video on water bowls for today. And I thank you for watching. If you like more videos, subscribe and hit the bell for updates. So let us have a wonderful day. Thank you for watching.